We must be covered by a thousand feet of snow. It could be days before they find us. Hmm. No books, no radio, no board games. Ah, a Bazooka Joe comic. Ugh, I heard that one 75 years ago. We could build snowmen. No, I have a better idea. We could build real men out of snow. Oh. Okay. Ah, 206 bones, 50 miles of small intestine, full pouting lips, where this fellow is less a snowman than a god. Well, we've managed to stave off cabin fever for a few hours. I, uh, I think we should dress the snowmen. Agreed. Look at them. Smug and secure in their finery. Mucking us. Uh, they're just snowmen, Mr. Burns. Ah, uh, snowmen have peepers. Peepers to watch. To watch for a moment of weakness, and then baff comes the knock on the head, and we're down. What do we do? Oh, wouldn't you like to know? I am trapped with a madman. Look at him, staring into me, filling my mind with paranoid thoughts. Look at his eyes. He's trying to hypnotize me, but not in the good Las Vegas way. <gasps> I know what he's up to. He's thinking of killing me and riding my carcass down the mountain to safety. He's truly gone mad if he's thinking that. Well, he can't kill me if I kill him first. I'll kill you, you bloated museum of treachery. You and what army? <gasps> Stand back. I have powers. Uh, political powers. It's showtime! Protect this rocket house and all who dwell within the rocket house. Oh, something's wrong with its brakes, Gary! March, kid. Well, Simpson, I must say. Once you've been through something like that with a person, you never want to see that person again. You said it, you weirdo.